Well, Will, uh, day two of pre-season, uh, your first uh, real experiences of Exeter Chiefs, what have you made of it all? Yeah, it's, it's, um, it's been a cu tough couple of days, lots of testing, lots of just seeing how the boys come back from the break and stuff, but uh, I've really enjoyed it so far. As a player, I suppose pre-season is a necessary evil, it's something you don't really look forward to, but you have to get get through it. No, it's one of those things, you just got to, it's part of the package now, being a rugby player, you've got to come up and work hard in the off-season and in pre-season, hopefully I'll you know, be good come season starts. Like I say, it's only early days, but what have you made of pre-season so far? It's, it's, a, it's a tough environment, but um, as a player, you probably won't want to be in any other environment other than to test yourself every day. So, so far, yeah, it's been good. And settling in? Yeah, good? love it, yeah. Um, settled in, so yeah. I know when we spoke in the summer, you talked about how excited you were about the Chiefs and how you'd seen from afar, you'd come across them in the past. Uh, what really attracted you to Exeter and coming down here? Um, well, obviously, it's, um, I've heard a lot in the press of how, you know, how the boys are you know, real good here. They work really hard and I like the way they play. They play a real good, nice brand of rugby and hopefully it'll suit my game. There's a lot of uh, battle for the number nine shirt there, but you seem uh, all friendly banter there already. Yeah, yeah, we all, we all work hard off the pitch and they seem a real good bunch of boys off the pitch, so I'm sure we'll, we'll get the best out of each other. And what are your thoughts ahead of the new season? Now? It's going to be a big year for the club again, not just in the Premiership, but Heineken Cup for the first time as well. Yeah, no, um, we set our goals yesterday and uh, you know set ourselves high targets, so you know, hopefully we can achieve all of them. Brilliant. It's fine. Sweet. Well, and uh, day two of pre-season with the Chiefs, uh, how's life? Settling in? Uh, not too bad. It was uh, heavy today. No, so we're pretty tired at the moment, but uh, good to get in, involved with the lads, and uh, hopefully things go well. We were just saying to Will, uh, it's, it's like first day at school for you, you've got new friends yeah, to yeah, make, yeah. and uh, oh, yeah. a necessary evil, I suppose, pre season. Yeah, well, one of the reasons I came over here was you know, for a fresh start, so it's nice to uh, meet new boys and hopefully, you know play good rugby with them. you got a few Irishmen in the camp there, so yeah, does that make it right. e easier settling in? Oh yeah, well uh, they understand me a bit better than everybody else, so uh, you know it's good. Steno from back home obviously, and then Shay the physio, they're both from Northern Ireland, so you know, yeah, they'll help me settle in. What have you made of uh, life at the Chiefs so far? I know it's only early days, but uh, yeah, what, no, what have you made of the club and that? Yeah, I'm very impressed, you know, the facilities are top quality and um, you know, really enjoying being here so far and everybody's been really friendly, so Hopefully. Looking ahead to the new season though, it's, it's exciting times for the club, not just in the Premiership, Heineken Cup, something you've tasted already, yeah. uh, well, what, what can we expect? The Heinekens are, all the Heineken games are massive occasions of the world, also anyway, you know, so that'll be something we really look forward to. Obviously the club did really well last year and you know, I was very impressed from what I saw um, watching the boys last year, so hopefully you know, we can keep going upwards and, and get even better results this year. I know when we spoke in the summer you said the Rabo uh, offers something, but the Premiership offers, offers something different for you. One of the reasons why you came in? I think uh, the Premiership will be more competitive altogether. You know, sometimes the Rabo games was we've been taken out of because you know um, there, there wasn't that much to play for with the Premiership. There's there's always a lot to play for, so hopefully that greater sort of competitiveness will be will be good for my game. Looking at it today, you seem to have settled in, and the boys are uh, making you feel feel at home. With them. Yeah, yeah, all well, the lads have been great. Everybody's really friendly. Uh, Everything's going well so far, so I'm very happy. Personally, what are you expecting from the season itself? Uh, personally, you know, I'd like to play as many games for extra as I can, break into the team, you know, and uh, get involved, get involved in the Heineken games, and uh, you know, hopefully, have a few big games at the end of the season and something to play for. A bit like back home, it's a, a massive rugby area, and uh, yeah, have, yeah. You, have you found that out already? And uh, bits and pieces, you know, we see a lot of Chiefs tops around the shops and all. So yeah, I knew that uh, you know, the southwest sort of, you know, a big rugby area in England, and it's all the graves growing down here. So you know, hopefully, uh, good to be part of. I know you got the weekend off now, but next week it gets even tougher apparently. So. Yeah, yeah, well, it, it doesn't get any easier for that way until you know the games sort of start again. So um, you know, I'm expecting a tough time, but uh, hopefully, come out the other side in the end. Thanks, mate.